for chart, maybe maybe you did time this. But look how risky that is. Why why would you fight against this when you can literally sit and wait and and get into a buy, get into this wick pullback? You know what I'm saying? Like why why would you fight with this sale? Why even bother? Check this out. And I gotta I gotta do it this way, y'all, because my computer lagging when I when I um go live. So you could have easily just put a trend line up. If price don't break the trend line, then it's not a sale. So check this out. This is this is literally how I'm just trading. You know what I'm saying? Like common sense. Like, like where are the buyers coming in at? Where does the buyers live at in this market? Forget. Forget this MACD and all this other bull crap and this RSI. That junk is a joke. Look at this. It, 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 it serves its purpose. But look, where, where does the buyers come in at? You can't, you can't really see where the buyers come in at because you got to go left. You got to go left. All right. Where, where, did the, um, where did the market turn around at? So you just put the pieces together. You put the pieces together. You looking at all of this structure right here. You looking at this supply zone. You looking at this supply zone. You looking at this double top. And that's what helped you time these pullbacks. This pullback. Cuz I'm cuz I'm getting confirmation. It's really that simple though. Like, I ain't gonna say like it's really like that's like this part is that simple. It's it's more to it than that. Like, you know what I'm saying? I ain't finna be up on here lying to y'all. Like, like it's just a cakewalk. Cause everything is a risk and it is like some thinking and you gotta think a certain way. You know what I'm saying? So I ain't finna sit up here and be acting like this is just a cakewalk. But it can be easier though, for sure. So I use the 50 moving average. When price is on top, it turns green. When price is below it, it turns red. All right. So for an example, I mean, you could either you could play this a couple different ways because when price, you know that this is an uptrend, right? Look at this big uptrend. This is a big uptrend, right? So if price goes below it, you see how price went below the 50? I'm not going to just be hyped about a sale right away. I'm not going to be hyped about a sale. What what I'm going to wait and see what happens like i'm gonna wait and see what type of consolidation happens up in here but look at this if price breaks below it and then breaks back above it we back into the trend so that's an entry there if you wanted to but what i really was saying was you put it put a trend line here and and i put a trend line right here these are my points one and two one and two that they're my trend line points because price made a higher high now I'm not really looking forward to the sale. I'm looking to see what's going to happen around this trend line point. So when price came down to this trend line, it's either going to break it or it's going to hold it. One or the other. And also, team, the 50 moving average is sitting right here. So I'm probably going to be like waiting for it to break everything. That's how I would trade it. We're in an uptrend. Why am I fighting against any sales? Like, why am I fighting for sales? How about you just sit down and wait? Stay disciplined. Don't touch any sales until a sale is confirmed. No, it didn't break the trend line. And it, look, forget the trend line. It didn't break back through the 50. So because that didn't happen, now we literally just... Taking entries. Once it shoot, once it shoot above this high, once it shoot above that high right there, we taking entries. It's like literally, I just make it that simple. If it's high impact news, I'm not gonna touch it. So after doing that type of analysis, I'm gonna go to um I'm gonna be doing all that on a 30 minute chart. 30 minute chart, pretty much. 30 minute and 15. Them 30 minute is when I be looking at for like candlesticks, wicks, different things like that. 15 minute, I'm entering. If I'm looking for a pullback, I'm entering on the 15.